Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this eTrailer tongue weight scale for campers and utility trailers. It has a 2,000 pound capacity. Now tongue weight will refer to the weight that a fully loaded trailer will exert downward on the hitch ball of your tow vehicle. And knowing that tongue weight on your trailer is pretty important. And the reason is, is too little tongue weight can cause your trailer to sway. Too much tongue weight could cause the vehicle to perform poorly. So you may have difficulty steering, gaining traction, or braking when driving a setup that has too much weight pushing down on the rear of your vehicle. So ultimately towing with an improper tongue weight could cause you to lose control of the vehicle and it could even cause your trailer to separate from the vehicle. So by using the scale, this will give you a nice quick and easy way to find out your tongue weight on your trailer. This scale will measure your trailer's tongue weight, helps ensure the trailer is properly loaded, and it'll let you know if you need to adjust the load before you tow it. Just want to zoom in to show you, it has a scale right here that will measure the tongue weight. And also what's nice about this, you can use this to measure it in two easy or convenient ways. One of them would be if you want to measure your trailer's coupler before the trailer's hooked up. So if your trailer is just sitting by itself and you wanted to measure the tongue weight at that time, you can just put this under the coupler. And if you need to raise the coupler, raise up the coupler, stick this under the coupler, drop the coupler, crank your jack or lower your jack down onto this. And then once you get it lowered down to where it's resting on here, it'll register an amount there and that'll tell you what the tongue weight is, just like that. Now this scale will show each increment is 50 pound increments. So it does go all the way up to 2,000 pounds, but it'll register what your tongue weight is just like that. Pretty simple. The other way you can measure it, you can measure at the trailer's jack if, your, if the trailer is already hooked up to your vehicle. And you can just put this in place of the jack. So what you want to do is raise your jack up, take the foot plate off the bottom of your jack that's on the trailer. And then what you'll do with this scale, pop out the pin and clip here, pop out the pin and clip at the bottom, remove this extension piece, put it to the side. And instead of, you don't want to put it this way, what you want to do is you notice there's a hole in this ball portion up here, flip it over, line the hole up in there with the hole in the foot plate. Clip it in and now you notice you're ready. There's an opening here that the inner tube, if you have a two inch, most jacks, the inner tube would be two inches. And this will allow that jack to go right in there. So you'll slide this up under the jack on your trailer that you've taken the foot plate off. Let it rest in there, crank it down. Once it gets cranked down all the way, then all you have to do is raise up your uh, the vehicle that it's hitched to to take off some of the load on it. And it'll measure your tongue weight just like that. Same way, look at the gauge and I'll tell you what the tongue weight is. So either way with this scale, you can measure it if the trailer is by itself, just by using the coupler, or if it's hooked up, you can use it by attaching it to the jack. Pretty simple to do. If you notice on this, there's a sturdy steel foot plate. Helps this keeps the scale level for a nice accurate reading. And it is zinc plated on the foot plate and the pins to help resist corrosion. If you notice the body on this, this is aluminum. This portion is aluminum also few specs on this now. Let me just pop this pin out, flip it back over. But this will fit one and seven eighths inch, two inch or two and five sixteenths ball coupler with this top portion. And on the inside, if you're going to use it on the jack, it will fit jacks with a two inch inner diameter tube. <clears throat> now, of course, like we mentioned, either the foot or the wheel that is on your jack will need to be removed for this to be attached to it. Capacity again is 2,000 pounds. So first, what I want to do is we're going to give you some measurements. <clears throat> Let's do it. We'll measure the overall height. Let's put it back together if you're going to measure at the jack. <clears throat> so the overall height on it this way. If we go from the bottom to the very top, maximum height is 7 and 1 8 inches. Now the foot plate itself, the dimension on the foot plate, that is going to be, oh, let's do it this way. Foot plate is six and three eighths inches long by four and a half inches wide. And then let's measure the height. If we change it over to measuring at the coupler, where we're going to put the extension in. Pick our pins back up. Hook this up, line the holes up in it. Now if we measure the overall height, you're going to be right at 17 and a quarter inches. Now one note I do want to mention is that the 
This e-trailer tongue weight scale is not intended as a trailer support device, so the scale should not be left on the jack during travel or storage. You don't want to let it rest on here. But that should do it for the review on the e-trailer tongue weight scale for campers and utility trails. It has a 2,000 pound capacity.